Hello everyone, today we are going to discuss about energy management system for a hybrid electric source. This is application for a more electric, electric aircraft. Here uh, this example shows energy management systems for a fuel cell hybrid electric source. And also this example illustrates a simulation model of a fuel cell based emergency power system of uh, more electric uh, uh, aircraft that is called as MBA. How to get this model in my MATLAB command window just you uh, you type power underscore fc hps underscore mea then we will get the model like this okay then this model and the, the fuel cell uh, fuel cell model that is a fuel cell power ma power module uh, this model contains uh, contains the fc pm controller and also uh, fuel ch fuel cell stack here itself we can uh, select the uh, block and also uh, you will get the parameters you, you have to choose this parameters what, what type of parameters you need you can uh, set, uh, set this then signal variation and fuel cell dynamics these are the parameters you can uh, vary it is this fuel cell stack implements a generic hydrogen fuel cell model which allows uh, simulation for the following type of cells that is a proton exchange membranes fuel cell and a solid oxide fuel cell yeah, that is SO, SOFC PMFC and AFC that is alkaline fuel cell uh, size it is a stack we can check also we can view the pl plot uh, VA characteristic that is a stack voltage versus current or stack power versus current you can also uh, see the plot characteristic and also we can see view cell parameters view, uh, fuel, fuel cell nominal parameters stack what is the stack power what is the cell resistance and uh, what is the nominal consumption and also uh, and also we can uh, check the power uh, check the parameters here this is a FCPM controller uh, then this is a fuel cell uh, a hybrid power system is designed based on a profile that is a uh, we have 12.5 kilowatt that is a peak 3260 volt uh, PEM that is a proton exchange membrane already we discussed this uh, what is that what type of uh, fuel stack, uh, stack that is a proton exchange membrane fuel cells in this example we are using PEM FC uh, uh, which nominal power of uh, 10 kilowatts we are taking uh, taking now then a yeah, 40 a yeah, 40 48 volt for 40 mm ampere hour uh, uh, lithium ion battery we are uh, using this in this my this type of model also we can vary uh, lead acid ba battery or uh, nickel cadmium or ni nickel metal hydride you can here itself we can set the nominal voltage here uh, in this example we are setting a yeah, 48 and 40 40 mm, uh, rated capacitor that is a h capacitor lithium uh, lithium ion battery system is used then the super capacitor uh, that is a, it is a, a 291.6 volt uh, rated voltage and 15.6 uh, rated capacitance so that is a 15.6 farad super capacitor system here it is a six series uh, we are using 648.6 uh, cells in series the then only we will get the 291.6 uh, volt this uh, this plug parameter that is a super capacitor mask implements a generic super capacitor model which allows the simulation of electric double layer capacitor that is a ED, edlc here you say a stand model that is a uh, self discharge here itself we can define your own parameters this operating uh, temperature celsius is 25 the initial voltage 270 here the number of series capacitors are 108 number of parallel capacitor is 1 then here uh, there are uh, three type of uh, dc to dc boost converter uh, is involved uh, a yeah, 12 watt this is a 12.5 uh, kilowatts uh, kilowatts fuel cell and also this is a boost converter with re with regulated output voltage and current limitation options is a uh, average value dc to dc bo boost converter block this block implements an average value of uh, dc to dc boost converter two inputs are provided for output voltage regulation and the input current limitations here itself we can specify the efficiency response time and load capacitance is there here the uh, again we can uh, set the value for uh, uh, requirements Uh, here uh, the, this two uh, DC to DC converter for uh, discharging uh, the first one is a 4 kilowatts boost converter and the second one is for uh, charging that is a 1.8 uh, 
clovers buck buck converter the um, the battery system here using normally a single uh, bidirectional dc to dc converter can also be used to reduce the weight of the power system the so first one is a uh, 15 kilo uh, kilo volt ampere to 270 volt dc in 200 volt and ac ac value of 400 hz uh, inverter system and uh, yeah three phase ac load uh, ac load with variable uh, apparent power and uh, power fuels to emulate a mea emergency load profile and also um, a yeah, 15 kW watts um, protecting resistor to avoid overcharging and the super capacitor and uh, battery systems here there are uh, an energy management system uh, which distributes uh, the power among the uh, energy sources according to the given uh, energy, energy management system here there are five types of uh, energy management st- uh, strategies are uh, implemented here what is the five types here uh, strategies state machine control strategy classical pa control strategy frequency decoupling and uh, Uh, state machine control strategy equivalent consumption minimization uh, strategy that is called ecms and another one is the important one is the eems external energy ma- maximization uh, strategy this blocks implements the six types of energy management strategies commonly used in uh, fuel uh, cell hybrid systems here the ecms and eems control strategies require the optimization toolbox matlab optimization toolbox and then the Uh, the state machine control strategy is selected automatically when the toolbox is not available if 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 your uh, matlab version is not available in automatic to- toolbox means it automatically select the state machine control strategy this one then how can you see the measurement you have to click on the measurement just you click run uh, here there are uh, four options are four converters four uh, m- modules are there here uh, the first one is a fuel cell here uh, this fuel cell contains uh, fuel cell voltage and fuel cell current uh, and fuel consumption and fuel uh, these are all the uh, outputs we can see the simulation is going on here uh, this l file is available here this is uh, in go, go to search help uh, type energy management system for a hybrid electric source uh, here you can see the demonstration um, b- what is going on uh, when, uh, when simulation is run at uh, at uh, time 0 second the essential loads are supplied by the main generator and the fuel cell hybrid power system is turned on to prepare an uh, unlikely emergency landing situation up to uh, 330 seconds uh, it shows uh, step by step uh, descriptions source the battery current and battery voltage and the state of charge here uh, if there is any, if there is any, any error uh, to build this model means just you change the um, uh, data acceleration mode there is a stop time here uh, i am choosing uh, choosing the um, accelerator mode here if you are cho- choosing a normal mode you will get the output now you can see the running is going on it takes some more time because uh, th- th- we are setting 350 uh, uh, seconds are there 350 seconds then now only it starts with 30 0.143 in that you can see the power load cell other 
means you can choose rapid as accelerator to see the output you can see here this were the uh, um, FC converter input voltage and battery converter input voltage <coughs> if you are using slow process you will get like this there is a fuel cell uh, voltage and fuel cell current and fuel consumption fuel consumption and then the power power also you can see the power load fuel cell battery uh, with ultra capacitor fuel cell load this a power shows uh, load power and fuel cell power and battery power that is ultra capacitor uh, in parts the all the things the four uh, power uh, scopes are available in single plot similarly you can check uh, with this energy management systems here this is a battery current and battery voltage similarly the super capacitors ultra capacitor uh, current and voltage curve that is a separate one load line voltage versus per phase current uh, scope is there here also some tools are available here if you want to uh, see the legend click legend you see the line voltage and one line. next one also this configuration uh, properties are also available here in this properties you can set the uh, number of input ports and sample time input processing and the sample based or uh, frame based so you can choose your access scaling you can use my manual or auto mode otherwise you can set your own configuration using this uh, configuration block okay, so in this manner you can see the energy management uh, systems for a hybrid electric source the, uh, the model description is available in uh, YouTube uh, model the uh, YouTube description page also this model can be downloaded uh, from this uh, uh, YouTube cha YouTube channel description box. Thank you.